Assalamu alaikum. It's me Halak Maryam Furrican and today I'm presenting a short video on disorder of RBC which is thalassemia. Thalassemia is an inherited blood disorder in which the body makes an abnormal form of hemoglobin. The disorder results in excessive destruction of red blood cells, which leads to anemia. Anemia is a condition in which your body doesn't have enough normal, healthy red blood cells. About 1 million babies worldwide are born with severe forms of thalassemia each year. Thalassemia occurs most frequently in people of Italian, Greek, Middle Eastern, Southern Asian and African ancestry. This disorder can be classified into two types alpha, thalassemia and beta, thalassemia. The severity depends on how many of the four genes for alpha globin or two genes for beta globin are missing. It is estimated that 1.5% of the global population carries gene causes of thalassemia. Genes control how the body makes hemoglobin protein chains. When these genes are missing or altered thalassemia occur. Thalassemia are inherited disorders they are passed on from parents to their children through genes. People who get abnormal hemoglobin genes from one parent but normal genes from the other are carriers. Symptoms of thalassemia. It may include loss of appetite, dark urine, pale skin, weakness, bone problems, fatigue, enlarged spleen. Diagnosis of thalassemia. It's typically made by blood tests including a complete blood count, hemoglobin electrophoresis tests and genetic analysis, treatment for thalassemia. It depends on the type and severity. The treatment for severe form of disease often includes regular blood transfusion, iron collation therapy, a process by which excess iron from the body and supplementation of folic acid, and bone marrow transplantation may be used to cure the condition especially in young people. Success rate is 80 to 90%. That's all about thalassemia. Thank you for watching.